Welcome to Team Talk, where we learn what Marysville High School students are thinking. Hello and welcome to Team Talk on M6, your hometown station. We interviewed the juniors and seniors of Marysville High School and asked them to describe themselves as a student and also to explain their answer. Uh, I would describe myself as a student as someone who um, likes to be efficient when, with their work and try to actually learn something out of it, not just, uh, you know, cop, like when you do vocab, I'm not just copying the words down, I'm trying to actually get something out of it so I can make myself a smarter person. I would describe myself as a pretty smart student, but try not to be too arrogant. I try to also be pretty funny, which it's true, I'm pretty funny. Um, I would say I'm a pretty diligent student because I've been taking um, a couple of AP classes and higher like, curriculum at the school, and I usually get all my work done. Um, as a student, I think I'm, I have a lot of ambition to do what I need to do, but not quite enough to actually do my homework enough, though I have like good intentions. I describe myself as an average student, like a little on the nerdy side, but really don't like waking up early in the morning and don't like homework at all. What is your advice to eighth graders who are coming to the high school? My advice for eighth graders is uh, your freshman year is arguably your most important year. Um, many people uh, slack off their freshman year and it's really hard to get your cumulative GPA back up if you already started down. I'd say pay attention in all four of your high school years because when you're in middle school, colleges don't look at your grades too much, but in high school, Every year counts, so you don't want to get left behind in one year. Uh, work on your schoolwork, but don't let it consume you. Try and do stuff you truly want to do and figure out what you want uh, the rest of your life. I think that will help you shape your high school career. Um, I think the most important thing you need to do is not mess up your freshman year. It's super important because I kind of did and you're going to find your passion eventually. You're going to find what you want to do with your life and if you already have that screwed up, you're, you're going to be done. You're not going to be able to do what you need to do to get yourself there. Um, I would say it's really important to enjoy your time here because you're always looking forward to becoming an upperclassman and then becoming a senior and then graduating and moving on to college. So just try to enjoy your time while you're here. What rewarding classes have you taken, whether it was personally or academically? I would have to say my most rewarding class would be AP World because it allows me to look at the world in a more open perspective and it gives me a chance to earn college credit because it's an AP class. Um. So one class that affected me personally would probably be performing arts. It kind of gets you out of your shell and gets you out and talking to different people and expressing who you really are without being judged. Um, the most important class I think I've taken is probably band. It's really kind of opened up my creative side of how I think and it's kind of shown me what I want to do with my life. Personally, I think personal finance is what have to be my favorite because like it's directing me into what I want to do for my career and now I know how to do it. Um, last year I took AP Physics and I really liked that class because it kind of challenged me and it kind of put me in the direction of what I wanted to do. Thank you for watching Tea Talk and be sure to join us again on M6, your hometown station.